be patient, people. Be patient. Things are happening in the world for a reason. Things are happening for a reason. These people know the wrath of God when they see it. But they're not going to try to point that out to you because they don't want you to know that. And they know they fear the Lord. And the Lord has spoken. And he's going to speak some more. Just watch. As the Lord speaks. And as you feel the earth shake. And as times moves faster, people die. Jesus tried to warn us about the things to come, and not many listen. But now people see it, and they're starting to see more. You ever heard of that saying from your mom? I brought you into this world. I take you out. How do you think the Lord feels about that? Because that saying came from him. He's the only one that can I can think of that would say something like that. See, the people take advantage of the Lord's kindness and his warm heartedness and think God can't get very cold. See, a person that's very that's full of love can be very cold. And when the Lord gets tired, he gets tired and his cup is overflowing. God is very angry. And now he's showing every man what he can do. And he's going to do more than that. So as long as people turn their back on the Lord and turn their back on Jesus like they don't exist there's more things cleverly going to happen in this world to clever men that feel like God doesn't exist now you can take this any type of way you want to take it people but that water have overflowed the cup and now God is answering this is happening worldwide. It's not just happening in one place. It's happening worldwide. Floods. Tornadoes. Super tornadoes at that. Earthquakes. Birds falling out of the sky. Fish washing up on shores. Rivers turning to blood. People, what more do you have to see? What more do you have to hear? Wake up. Only thing you have to do is crack open the Bible, the Holy Bible, and you can see everything that's happening in the world is in the Bible. I mean, don't run, don't run to the Lord when it's time to go, because then it'll be too late. So, I say this to you. Open up your eyes and your ears and see what's happening to the world. The sun is even spitting off fire. No, and, and people when I like it's just a worldly thing. It's just a worldly thing. Atheists, if you don't wake up and start seeing that these things are happening be, behind the hand of God, I don't know what else to tell you. You're going to be lost and you're going to be too late. You're going to be too late. Just go ahead and keep on not believing. Just keep believing that this is just futuristic stuff. This is just the world. It is a such thing, you know, this is, it, it is global warming. You know, just <laughs> go ahead and keep believing that. Go ahead, keep, keep on listening to man tell you that it's, everything going on has to do with global warming. <laughs> keep on. Global warming. Yeah. Mm-hmm. See, what they're not going to tell you is, is not everybody believe in God and Jesus. You know, some people believe in nothing. 
and you know they just get up every day and just do the same thing every day and don't have no kind of belief whatsoever and that's why things happen to them because they have no belief source you know but in the end there will be some belief source it will be because it's going on right now you notice how the earth is falling apart I wait yeah the earth is falling apart sinkholes all over the place I guess that's just random huh that's that's just something that just happens think back in your little stupid little life and think was this happening before when you was growing up think back in your life where it was this many tornadoes happening all over the world sandstorms just covering up cities hmm this is crazy. You ever known earthquakes to happen all over the world at the same time? Have you ever known water to be up under concrete and move a whole city? Have you ever known that? No, I don't think you've known that. Have you ever known a tidal wave to come over and wipe out a whole city? Oh, back in Noah's days when the giants was around. But you never seen nothing like that when the short people was around like us. You better open up your eyes and start seeing that God is not playing with you. He's not playing with this world no more. And he's coming back. And he's he's, he's doing this thing because people still don't want to recognize. Until you recognize, is when you fall. I'm Wallet. I'm going to hit you all up with a, with a part two. So, get your thinking cap on. All right.